Yeah, there's a very happy groom here, and uh, he's talking to Shazzy. Yeah, yeah, yeah Shazzy, you and him, Shazzy, in the, in the pubs in the old days. Class of eight has won it for uh, Wayne Bardenhorst and the team. But I want to, before I focus on the winners, I just want to ask uh, your opinion on Bint Al Malak. Uh, I thought it was a very good run. Very good run, going back over the mile, an uh, uh, exceptionally good ride. Ran hard, you know, the pace held up most of the day, it's held up, and this horse uh, got clear of us, but tried to the line. We're very happy. Owned by a great guy, Brian Riley. So, another 20 odd grand in the coffers. Thank you very much, Paul, and uh, wonderful to chat to you about Bint Al Malak. But uh, there's uh, Yusei Ramzan into the winner's enclosure class of eight for Wayne Barden Horst. Mr. Standerven is the owner, and young apprentice uh, uh, Yusei Ramzan has brought this one home. It is a Scott Brothers bred horse by Eightfold Path out of class of her own and Barbara's with me and uh, uh, Barbara's going to one day speak to me on TV. One day Barbara's going to speak to me but uh, she's not going to talk today but uh, class of eight's won it and uh, it's been a wonderful day's racing. 43711 are the numbers you'll need for the last time from Warren and Kevin we bid you farewell. Race eight has gone to class of eight, number four from the Wayne Bardenhorst stable. Good second to Miss Rosa Parks last time out. You're looking for another honest performance and she's pulled it out the fire today. Yes, Sheldon, she's very honest. She's, every time I bring her to the races, she earns a check. Um, she's very temperamental, but it's amazing. She can run all the time and she just keeps going. She's one of those bread and butter horses and now she's got the, the big check. So we'll see how she goes out the maidens. Yeah, I think she'll be honest at the maidens. Hey? She's an honest horse. She tries her best. Uh, hopefully they don't push her too much. And then she's competitive in those low merit rated races. Uh, well done to you and the team. Yeah, and thanks to Sean. He's been very loyal to me in that and all good. Uh, and he's been very loyal to Jose because, yeah, you know some owners might want to change him, but he stuck with him and he's done, done well on her. She goes the 14 and she goes the mile, but she found extra today. It looks like it, and it looks like maybe you can go further because of, uh, I think the half-brother is a uh, top classman. He goes to four, so, yeah, and I want to say thanks to my staff as well. They, they've been working hard. I've been running around and everything, but all good to them. Well done. Thanks very much, eh? Let's get Jose Ramsden into the picture. He's going to come forward, and he knows class of eight best. Now, you leave the ring early with her, and you just got to keep her quiet. Yeah, you know, uh, she's always uh, leaving early because she gets very fresh and worked up. And, uh, you know, I went down, and today she, there was something about her. She usually, I usually get her to, like, walk down quietly, but she was just jumping all over the show, and I knew this filly as well, you know. So, uh, yeah, you know, um, Mr. Barton was pretty simple instructions, you know. You just, this horse always uh, goes to the front. I just let her stride along in front where she was comfortable. And, uh, you know, I just picked it up coming into the straight, and she galloped on well. And uh, I just want to say a big thank you to Mr. Barton and also the owner is stuck by me a lot. He's very loyal. And, uh, you know, just great stuff and well done to the team. Good end. Well done. Thank you, sir. That's Jose Ramsden. And then Kevin Shea is going to step in, former champion jockey. The winning groom is going to get his 1,000 rand token. Safiso. Well done, Safiso. There's Kevin Shea, left-handed shake. And he's going to give you your 1,000 rand token. And well done to all concerned today. That is the running of race number eight.
Well, action-packed day at the races today, but we go to race two, number seven, Donetto. Keegan DeMello for the Mark Dixon stable. Haley and the Bernards, slow into stride, had to come from off the speed, and the money horse gets up in the latter stages. Let's take a look at Donetto spinning for home. Elusive force, but Fred has gone right out again. Dinetto's on the inside, Timber's running on. Still Fred the leader, Elusive force. Dinetto and Timber running on down the inside. Fred still leads it. Down the inside, Timber and Dinetto's also putting in a claim. It's Fred, Elusive force. Dinetto on the inside, Timber. They get to the line. Dinetto won it. Second will go to Timber. Third, Elusive force, and Fred ran fourth. Still learning the ropes is Donetto in the second race. The Water Winters come through and gets up on the winning post.